Welcome back, and when we last left off, uh, this right upper wing skin plug was up on the mill and just getting underway. And now this is a little bit uh, later on on Saturday morning, and you can see actually quite a lot's been done already. And so here it's uh, got the ball mill here and just doing the very leading edge of the wing there. And there was still a few more bits and pieces to do before I could slide it down, so I mean I was pretty much in the shop all all day on uh, Saturday until about 4 p.m. before I could finally slide it down and get it started on the other side. And Chris and Roberto were also in there in the morning and so here's uh, both of them just doing some trimming on some of the other molds that had been laid up in the past. So there's one there for the uh, front seat braces that Chris is working on and uh, there's one of the cowling ones that Roberto is working on. And this is uh, Monday afternoon, so that uh, particular plug off the mill now, just sitting on the floor. So that one's ready for guide coat and sanding, and pretty happy how that one came out. It's really, really getting good at doing this now, which is sort of uh, interesting given that we're getting sort of close to having everything done <laughs> and not having to do so many uh, plugs, you know, once we finish off with everything. And here you'll see a little bit of a close-up switch to the narrow angle lens here. So this is a close-up of the leading edge. You can see how nice that came out. And obviously, it still needs a little bit of sanding. A little little bit of uh, faceting around the edges there because I didn't put the step over quite so tight as what I did before. But it um, won't take much to finish that off. And so not wasting any time, we got number four up on the machine. So this is the left side upper wing skin. Uh, plug and so there's a rough cut just underway there in the foam as you can see and here's Devin making a little bit more progress on the uh, what is this one the right side lower wing skin plug and he's just that's had the one coat of primer and he's just sanding that back so it'll get the one more coat after that and some sanding it'll be ready for having a mold pulled and here's uh, Roberto working on uh, bulking up this mold that was uh, started there I guess uh, last week so putting the heavy layers of, um, of fiberglass on this one and there it is when it's all finished the next day so that one is now ready to be released and trimmed so that's the first of the wing strake uh, molds now done so obviously three more to go well, one more lower and two upper and here's that left side upper wing skin plug all finished now so didn't get a lot of video of that while it was underway but basically had that running overnight and then uh, finished it off this morning so here it is all prepped ready uh, to have the fiberglass uh, laid over that in order for it to get uh, its putty and then get back on the machine and that one came out really nicely obviously you know every time you do the second one of something it comes out better than the first one and uh, I didn't make a big uh, hole in the in the platform this time, which was good. And there's Devin again. He's made quite a bit of progress, and he's actually working on the flanges of the outboard part of the wing right now. So this one is probably going to be ready uh, tomorrow for the next um, coat of primer. And here's the door, the first of the door uh, mold. Um, sorry, door frame molds. So this one is the one that got um, the bracing put on it. And see it's been bolted together right now and has the little um, pins in there holding it together so that one just needs to be waxed and it's ready to lay up that door frame so that's uh, exciting because once the door frame comes together the rest of the door stuff comes together and we can start um, bonding the fuselage together together if everything fits nicely and here are Chris and Roberto um, putting down the heavy layer of uh, fiberglass on that uh, um, left side wing skin plug and just laying it out dry initially just getting it all trimmed and everything like that before they start putting the resin on there so that one will be ready uh, in the morning to have some putty sprayed on there so we may even get it up on the machine and get it started before uh, tomorrow night which would be good and lastly uh, Kyle sent through some pictures here so this is the upper large pulley for the belt drive system that's come through and that still needs to have some machining on there to reduce the weight of it uh, so he'll be doing that and next up you'll see uh, the belts came through for the belt drive system so there there's one of them there I guess um, anyway so I'm not sure if we'll have an update for Saturday given that we have the Thanksgiving uh, vacation here um, on Thursday and Friday but we'll see and if not we'll um, have another update for you uh, next Tuesday 
So as always, thanks for watching.